Hi, I'm Aaron, and we're going to be integrating cotangent to the fifth of x. And in this method, we're only going to be using cotangent and cosecant. And there's another method in my next video, which will be using sines and cosines. So we're going to start by splitting the cotangent to the fifth of x into cotangent cubed times cotangent squared. And then we can use the identity that cotangent squared of x is equal to cosecant squared of x minus 1. And we can substitute it in, and then we will have cotangent cubed of x times that identity. And what we can do then is distribute this, like so, and then split the integrals. So what we end up with is cotangent cubed of x times cosecant squared of x dx minus the integral of cotangent cubed of x. And for this, you're going to have to watch the third video in this series. But for in this video, I'll just write the answer so we can get the final result. For this integral, we can use a u substitution, where u is equal to cotangent of x. If we differentiate, we get du is equal to negative cosecant squared of x dx. We can plug this back in to get the integral of negative u cubed du minus the integral of cotangent cubed x dx. The integral of uh, u cubed is 1 fourth u to the fourth. And then the integral of cotangent cubed of x right here is this bit right here, which is negative 1 half cotangent squared of x minus the natural log of the absolute value of sine of x. And we can plug u equals cotangent of x back in, and we can distribute this negative right here, and they turn into positives. And so our final answer is negative 1 fourth cotangent to the fourth of x plus 1 half cotangent squared of x plus the natural log of the absolute value of sine of x plus c because it's indefinite. Whoops, and that's it. The cosecant squared of x, it, nah, that cotangent. <laughs>